Just wanted to take a couple of moments and show you this new feature, of course, that's in uh, 2019 12.1.1 at the very least anyways. And that is the battery warm up when you use a supercharger. So if I just go into my screen here and I pick uh, a supercharger that's a fair distance from me, let's say uh, 50 kilometers. I'll just pick that and let's just wait and see what it does here. Okay. So we're waiting for this. All right, so it's predicting I'm going to arrive with 66% uh, battery left. So if I, very quickly here, let me just go back and then what I'll do is I'll go to this particular supercharger. This is the one that it picked. And instead of picking the supercharger, I'm just gonna pick the area that's right next to it. So uh, this address right here, and let's see what it predicts this time. So it's predicting 68. So it's using approximately 2% um, of the battery in order to do the preheating when you re, uh, when you arrive at your supercharger location. So there you go. That answers uh, how much battery life you're going to do. I've done this several times now, and it shows it's, it's, it's about a 2% loss on there. But anyways, it doesn't matter because you're getting the supercharger anyways, and you're going to charge. On my car yesterday when I charged, um, I went to Burlington, and it had been upgraded to 150 kilowatt. And on my car, I was getting 113 kilowatt. I've never seen that, rain, uh, that kind of charge rate before. So definitely it, it's been boosted. The software updates happened on my car. So even though it's not in the release notes, um, I do have the uh, battery preheat function that they announced. So anyways, there you go. Hope you like it. Talk to you soon.